What's up, True Squad? It's your girl, Quietty, and I'm back. Got you with another video. With another video. All right, so you guys, I know I'm like super behind with my Vlogmas videos, and I know a lot of people are expecting me to give up and thinking I'm going to stop, but guess what? I'm not. So I had to put out three videos today and record them and edit them today. So this video right here, I'm going to be just doing some stuffed peppers. I just want to do like a quick cook with me type of video, show you guys what I'm cooking for dinner, I'm doing stuffed peppers. Um, so I got some hamburger. I got like some of these type of peppers, the green ones, and then I also have the colored peppers. Um, I have some white rice and then, of course, some cheeses to put in there. And I'm also going to be using um, this for the first time, some crushed pineapple. I thought in my head it'll taste good with pineapple, so I'm going to have it on the side to put in there. I'll let you guys know how it tastes. I also got some wines um, that we're going to have. Oh, shoot, I almost busted some wines that we got for dinner as well so if you want to see me cook this dinner then stay tuned even though i'm looking crazy but stay tuned and i'm about to cook this out for you okay so yeah so i got started on the food so right now i am boiling some water and i um have the hamburger cooking yes i cook my hamburger with a top on there because i feel like it cooks better i don't know why um while i'm cooking most of the time i usually have like a little glass of wine so i'm about to pour me some of this wine right here um <clears throat> it's a white sangria and i'm gonna pour that while i cook so i can get it crack i like it you feel me cheers oh my god so freaking good all right so with my hamburger i like it to get like brown a little bit before i start putting my season in there so i'm only going to put four different seasonings i'm going to start off with my salt and i'm going to use um basil go in with some black pepper i like lots of pepper in my food that's my favorite seasoning so and last but not least my garlic powder And then I'm going to mix that up. All right, so the hamburger is still browning. And while that's browning, the water is actually came to a boil. So I'm going to pour my rice in. All right, so I just mixed in my rice. And I took it off the eye so it can cool down. So I'm just going to let it sit for like five minutes. <clears throat> I'm letting it sit for like five minutes covered so it can get thickened. This is about to be good as a mother stunt, okay? I'm going to turn my stove on to 350 right now. Put it on 350 and then that way it can start preheating. And um, that way it be ready for when I put the peppers in there. So, girl. Alright, so I'm going to start cutting these peppers. I started rinsing them all first, so I'm just gonna rinse them. That's how I cut them first. Sorry for the view. So I'm just gonna cut the top straight off. So from the side, just so that the pepper can be opened. So it's open now. And then I'm just gonna gut it out, but keep the pepper whole. Like, don't rip it from out of the circle. You don't wanna break it. So, this is how it looks me just going around. Then, you wanna take the whole middle out, like that. And any pieces that might be in it, I'm just gonna throw that in the sink. Part of the pepper. <clears throat> So this is how it looks right here. I'm gonna rinse it out too. The little pepper that I took from it, I'm gonna cut those up in like little tiny pieces, like dice them. And then I'm gonna put that inside of the hamburger and rice as well. So I'm gonna dice the 
part I took off. That way it won't have to go to waste. Mine is the part at the top, top, top. Not the stem, but the rest of it. I'm going to show you how it looks. After you cut it, is this piece right here. That's the part that's at the very top. How it looks. So just cut up. These are going to be cut up. And I'm going to put this inside of the pepper too. With the hamburger and the rice. And it's going to taste so good. Alright, so the freaking rice is pretty much ready. I put some pepper, a little bit of salt, and some butter in the middle of it. Um, about to mix that all in. My hamburger. I put like a little milk in there and some sliced cheeses. I like sliced American cheese better than pretty much any other cheese to me. I love sliced cheese and like stuff like that with hamburger. So I put like a little couple of, like maybe like not even a cup of milk or nothing just a little couple of pours of milk and then i put the sliced cheese on top and then mix it up just cut the peppers out i'm only gonna make six right now i cut the peppers out before i stuffed them and i got all the pieces from what i cut off the top i cut those parts up and put it in a separate bowl because i didn't want to raise them even if i was using them for a different dish or something i didn't want to raise those peppers so Mm. This is so good. So we got this sangria right here. And that shit goes slap. 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 You feel me? Um, so basically, let me show y'all what I did. I added the rice to the hamburger. And then I put more cheese on there. Now by all means, you can use shredded cheese if you would like shredded cheese. But I prefer sliced cheese, sliced American cheese, because it's more cheese to me, and it's more it melts better, and that's just what I like. So I'm using that. I've been craving this junk for like a month. My sister had made some in her house, and it was my first time having stuffed peppers. And ever since then, I've been motherfucking hooked. Okay, okay. So yeah, I'm about to make this shit, and it's gonna be z. Wishes, you know what I mean? Just stuff these boys. <laughs> That's how much is left. Um, I just put the cheese on top and I'm about to put it in the oven for about like 10 minutes or until the cheese melts, and then it's gonna be done. And compliments of Dollar Tree. Look at them! Look, y'all! Look, 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 look! Hey, hey! So what I'm gonna do? I'm how I'm gonna plate it is I'm gonna put some of the stuffing down and then put this on top. I'm gonna show you. All right, so this is the exploding pepper. So I got the uh, pineapples, crushed pineapples around the brim of the stuffing it actually takes excellent with it and this is the pepper I have like different color peppers in there so I have some yellow and red and green peppers chopped in there and you see it's like exploding over and this is pretty much it this is Jada's plate she's about to be so happy she already tasted it and it's so good so thank you guys for watching this video it's been real let me know if you try this um, stuffed pepper or if you have tried it before. Let me know in the comments below. And thank you so much for watching my video. Even though I'm behind on Vlogmas, I swear I'm going to catch up. I swear I am. Um, I hope you like this type of video. I never did like a cook with me type of video. Um, I'm going to try to make it my videos as short as possible because I know that your time is valuable it's a holiday time and you got ish to do you know what i'm saying but hopefully you get this video a thumbs up and like it share it if you love it um comment below any type of ideas you have for me or anything that good or bad that you want to say to me and make sure you stay true to yourself because you are the true true squad peace out